Welcome back everyone. Hitting a deer while driving isn't an uncommon accident, but two friends in Minnesota have a different tale to tell. Reporter Jeff Wagner has more on how a night of fun turned into a frightening ordeal after they hit a bear. My friend Tyler and I we were going to go hang out with our friend Sam. Cynthia Thompson was looking forward to a Friday night with friends when plans got derailed. I remember being hit. I remember being whipped around the car. I was terrified. I didn't think that I was going to be OK. Like I literally thought that I was going to die. She and her friend Tyler were driving on Highway 25 headed to Brainerd. But on the way, they hit a bear in the dark of the night. It came out of nowhere. Like we didn't even have time to like stop. Like we hit it full on at 70 miles per hour. With that impact, it literally felt like we hit a brick wall. The car then rolled into a ditch, hitting trees along the way. I was able to follow my seatbelt, unbuckle myself, and then I laid underneath Tyler because Tyler had all the broken glass underneath him. I laid underneath Tyler and unbuckled him and let him land on me. Cynthia and Tyler were able to crawl out of the back window and flag down a passing driver for help. Cynthia went to the hospital in an ambulance with Tyler by her side. Responding law enforcement asked her mom if Cynthia wanted to keep the dead bear. She said no. And I didn't get to see the bear personally. I didn't want to see the bear. I wanted nothing to do with the bear because it was my car that got totaled. I just bought that car two months ago, too, and I just made my second car payment to it. It's a crash that could have been much worse, but is still hard to believe. He thought that we hit another car. I thought that we hit a deer, <laughs> but we were both wrong. Tyler is sore from the crash. Cynthia has a minor concussion, sprained ankle and bruises. The North Dakota State University baseball team is back home and tonight look to continue its winning ways. Devin is in next with those highlights.